normally don't like have to reroll two times and still not find <laughs> still not find the uh the boon you're hoping for so here we go what's going on Skelly? good in uh oh wait no that's perfect perfect okay it's gonna be em4 hades Ooh. em4 hades okay that's all right it's okay it's all right we're gonna be fine we got boldy we got boldy boldy's gonna save us We'll take the we'll take the regular special. I'm certainly not gonna take the uh, certainly not gonna take the epic attack. Oof. Wretches. Wretches. Ratchets. Easy, easy game. Nice finding a palm right away. Got him. From 30 to 42. You love to see it. Ooh. Aries. Sure. Sure, we'll take Aries. We should probably take this uh, Erebus Gate just for the fun of it. Oof, man, I don't want any of these. Let's go Blade Dash, I guess. Not, not real interested. I will keep fighting. Sure. Let's try this. Oh man, these are always so bad. It's gonna be like it's gonna be like a bunch of epic big chariots, and I'm gonna be so upset that we made this choice. Really, we really don't want. Actually, the the thing I'm most scared of in this room is the laser, the laser bros. Rocked it. Keep your trick, then. Short work. All right. We got no money. Ooh, do we steal from Caroline this early? We probably shouldn't. I mean, we do have Rama Bow. No, I'm just going to take Artemis. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I can't do it right now. I can't do it right now. Even though I know I should. Oh, it's so annoying. I shouldn't be using my attack. It's like, not the point. That's not the point of this. I'm supposed to use my <laughs> special. Okay, what do we got? Pressure points? Yeah, let's just go pressure points. Now that lightning can crit, pressure points is so fun. PP! We found some PP. A little bit of pee pee on a Tuesday night. Who else remembers that song? <laughs> ah, never mind. No one, no one remembers that. Let's do this. Always take pee pee. Pee pee is always the best. Ooh, static discharge. That's good. That's good. JP, no. You want to run, 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 run. Artemis is kind of a crybaby. Kind of a crybaby. Let's be honest. Big, big old crybaby. You never pick me. Just because I've got the worst god power. At least when other things. <laughs> Mambo number five. Oh no. No! Don't badmouth Artemis. Don't you dare to badmouth Artemis. Okay, we got Hunter's Mark. That's good. That's good for us. Oh, what do we get? 
Hammers are so fun with Rama because, like, Rama's so weird. Chain shot. I always like chain shot. Explosive shot is, like, really annoying with Rama. <laughs> she hot, though. She hot. Hey, classical goiter. <laughs> How could you even... <laughs> exactly. Chain shot's fun. It's, it's just fun. We just... We just... Demeter. Let's take a bunch of boons, man. Take a bunch of boons, even if we don't need them. Take a bunch of them. Right there. This was a time of my life when I listened to that on repeat. I'm not sorry. It's growing rather cold. It is growing cold, and yet, and yet. All right, crystal beam. That's a little weird, but take it. Getting that special won't really help us much. <laughs> a little bit of that, girl. Da da da. <laughs> uh. it's, it's a weird. It's a weird. Uh, it's a weird sentiment. Although maybe not, like, really a weird sentiment, just weird to me, I guess. I was never, like, I don't know. I, don't know, I never really thought that that was very... <laughs> it just wasn't realistic, okay? It wasn't realistic. <laughs> Heaven's Vengeance! All right, maybe we can get, uh, maybe we can find that duo boon. Can we, are we eligible for it? I'll check later when I'm not under the timer gun. Brian Seltzer Orchestra became famous again. 20! Dant. How's it going? Uh -oh. Look at the damage! Get her to stand still. It's bad news bears. It's all over. It's over! She's standing still again. She hasn't learned. She has not learned. Mm. Nice seeing you. Now, are we are we eligible? Are we eligible for the duo? With uh, with the dash is what I'm asking about. We are eligible for the duo, baby. That sounds like fun. Let's make that happen. Let's grab that duo. That sweet revenge duo. Do the last four fish catches come from chaos area? Um, maybe. Made it to Asphodel. Can't kill a Hades at 32 heat? Well, 32 is a big challenge, my friend. That took me a long time to do 32 heat. A long time. It's possible that the game was a little harder back then. I'm not sure, though. I, I haven't, like... It's really hard to compare. But I, it's, it's possible that it was. It's like, a lot of people are beating the game a lot faster than I did. And it's making me insecure, and so that's what I'm going to say. Uh, let's see. Hyper Sprint. Let's go Flurry Cast. Let's get those, let's get those lasers out faster now. Nice! Managed to surpass 16, 16 heat. Nice work. Way to use the Paul build. <laughs> Bro, can you just stand still and take the arrows that I send you? Oh, it's just not aiming. It's just not aiming for me. Let's go black metal. Just because it's weird. Hey, the maths. Thank you for following. 
<laughs> now you're missing Hades. Isn't it? Isn't? Isn't it just one of those things? You just you think you think you've had enough of Hades, and then it pulls you back in. Discharge. Static. Discharge. 40% bonus on the attack speed is really a pain in the butt. Oh yeah, that one that one is rough, dude. I I think that's the one that like like EM4 is tough, but when you make Hades 40% faster, things get real real challenging there, I think. That's where uh that's where the rubber meets the meets the road, as it were. Oh, he killed himself! He killed himself with a static discharge. Oh, come on. Come on. Give me the thing. We'll roll it. Engulfing for Okay, maybe Curse of Agony? Or Curse of Vengeance, I guess. A little curse of agony since we've got the bouncing shot. That makes sense. Good stress relief, just pure button mashing and placement, right? Yeah, just get get to this position, mash the buttons. Get to that position, mash the buttons. Do it a little faster this time. A little faster. <laughs> yeah, it's it's got a good balance of like skill, like technical mechanics with just like just like crazy stuff going on that you gotta just deal with on the fly. It's fun. It's such a good one. It's such a good game. Honestly though, I'm just, I'm so excited for uh, Supergiant's next project. Like whatever, whatever it ends up being, I'm so excited for it. Whether it's a Hades thing or if it's just something else. Ever played a roguelike called Curse of the Dead God? Absolutely I have, yeah. I like that one. I like that one pretty well. I I wouldn't say it's one that I get real enthused to, to jump back into. I know there, there are a, a few people that would really like me to get back into that game, but honestly I um it was a bit of a it was a bit of a downer for me in a lot of ways. Just be, just because of like the the environment of it, I guess? I'm not sure. It was really hard to... Hard games are, like, way hard, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, EM4 for the music alone. I hear that. That is true. Yeah, parrying is really tough. If you don't... If you're used to a game like Hades, or another game where, where dodging is the only way to avoid damage, it's the only active way to avoid damage, um... Going to a game like Curse of the Dead Gods can feel a little bit jarring. But there's so many games with the parry system, and I just I've never been good at parrying in any real in any in any game that I've ever played. Maybe that's not true. I'm trying to think. Like, was there a game that I parried a lot? <laughs> there might have been. I'm now I'm now feeling like I there was a there was a game that like I like way I really liked the parry system. What was that? Was there was there anything like that? Or am I just Is it family favorite on? Oh no, it's family favorite, not privileged status. Doggone. I'm a bummer. Now we're not gonna do any damage. Come on, let's get that crit cascade going, baby. Get them all crit. Crit. -d -d -d. Sekiro, the parry system is awesome. I've never played Sekiro. I should try Sekiro sometime. I like... 
I really liked uh, Dark Souls. The first Dark Souls I liked a lot. Uh, I liked... I, I guess I didn't really get too far into Dark Souls 2, two before I kind of got annoyed with it. Oh, we've got a bunch of weird ones. We've got Golden Touch on. How very strange. That's right. I think this is left over from the, uh, the farming run I did a while back. That was a long time ago, I feel. Okay. Um, we got zoops. We got, oh, we probably need the acorn. Yeah, the acorn. I did not play Demon Souls. No, I never I never had a PlayStation. So I never played any of those. Uh, and I know, is Demon Souls is out on, is that on, can you get that on PC right now? I don't think so. But no, I never, I never played any PlayStation games, never played any um, Xbox games. Well, I guess I played some Xbox games, but not, but not really. PS5 and PS3. Gotcha. Yeah, no, I heard great things about it. Uh, would you guys, like, come out of the woodwork and, like, fight a, fight a brother? Please? Why you gotta, why you gotta go hide from me like that? I know. I want a PS5 for Returnal as well. It looks so cool and fun. And it looks like it's, like, right up my alley. Like, but I just, I can't justify, I can't justify an entire monstrosity of a system. And I can't even, like, find one anyway, right? Like, it's not like, it's not like I can just find one. Get those, get that PP upgraded. Um, Daunt, I like some, but I have, I am known... I have been known to get sick to my stomach in a lot of uh, first-person games. And that's been, that's actually been for a while, like since I was in uh, college. I played Half-Life 2, and Half-Life 2, I got kind of sick to my stomach. I always joke that it's because I'm an old guy, but I, that was, I mean, I was a young guy back then. <laughs> and I still got kind of motion sick. Um, and if I'm being honest, like, Doom, I got sick to my stomach playing Doom. Like. Uh, there's no question. The one that I didn't get sick playing was uh, was Quake. I got Quake and I, I was able to play that one no problem. I'm not sure why that is. Maybe because it was like such a like there wasn't a whole lot of like running around in Quake. Like it was like you go one direction and you kill the things and and then the doors open and <laughs> it. Yeah, no, if you, if you, if that's your, if those are your types of games, oh uh, gosh, I'm not going to go to, I'm not going to go to Patroclus. Good heavens, what's happening? Something must be terribly wrong. Yeah, I, I played like, I guess, okay, I, I should take that back. I played a lot of like Counter-Strike and Counter-Strike didn't bother me. Really what it is, is if, if there's a game where I have to do a bunch of exploring in first person and I have to like look around for like secret buttons or keys and so I'm like traveling back and forth to the same locations over and over again, like I get to my, I get sick to my stomach when I'm doing that. Like that's, that is, uh, that's a recipe for disaster. So like Half-Life where you're trying to solve puzzles, oh. <laughs> it's just rough. Ooh, triple shot. It's not really, it's not really amazing, but fistful of frags. I, I, yeah, it looks, it certainly looks interesting. It certainly looks interesting. I actually, I like those, those ones where it's like very basic. Like the gameplay is just like simple. You're just running around like an, like an old school shooter. The way they used to be made where it was just like chaos. Like there's no story. There's nothing to, there's no puzzles. You just, you're in an arena and they're coming to kill you. And ah, you know, like, uh, what was that one that was serious? Sam, serious. Sam was kind of like that, right? <laughs> rare crop. Ooh, do we rare crop it? Of course we do. Of course we do. What are we thinking? Okay. Those are not the ones I might've chosen, but heaven's vengeance blade dash. Okay. Whatever. Listen, Pajama Sam. Serious. Serious Man Sam. Serious Sam Man. I do, Daddy. I do. And there's nothing you can do to stop me, Daddy. <laughs> I dare. Okay, I dare. He always said I wasn't daring enough. Let's grab this. 
This could be, what? What could this be? Double strike? Double strike would be sweet. <laughs> yeah. Hamburger became NBA suit. So, like, I played a lot of Overwatch back in the day. When Overwatch first came out, I was super, super into that game. But, um, yeah, I haven't really done uh, a lot of multiplayer shooters at all in a very long time. I'm trying to think what the next one... Whoa, the last one... Why? The last one would have been... Whoa! Yuleta Owl, thank you for the five gifted subs! Holy moly roly poly! Overwatch. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. Dang. Oh, we got vengeful mood. Wow, man. Thank you so much, Violetta Owl. What a what a what a friend. Oh, what a friend. What, uh, yeah, what, what, what brings you here with gifted subs in hand? <laughs> I, I appreciate it very much. Not that it needs an explanation. I just, you know. I, I appreciate it. Way too toxic. I feel that. <laughs> I feel that. That's kind of why I had to stop playing League of Legends, like, it was so distressing to play. Like, I would mess up, and, like, I would know I messed up. I'm like, shoot, I messed up. Dang, that stinks. And then, like, but for the next, like, half hour, there's this, there's a teenager, and he's just yelling my name over and over again. And, like, and at that point, like, there's no way I'm going to recover. But anyway, <laughs> MOBAs are the worst. I know. I know they are. I know it. Chris doesn't give it much attention because Smite is so big. What is knockoff free pa <laughs> paladins? Yeah, I never, I never played paladins. Though it sounds kind of fun. Sounds like a good one if you're into that sort of thing. Well, and now like free, like now shooters are mostly free. Like I mean, sorry, multiplayer shooters are mostly free. Like like all of the battle royale games, like. Uh, What's the what's the big Apex Legends? Apex Legend is a uh, is a uh, is a one. <laughs> That's a one. Halo Infinite will be free. Oh wow. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take my foot out of the cold again because holy moly, that is some cold 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 water that my foot is in. Look at these crits, my my dudes. Look at this. Look at all those lightning strikes. Now if we got double strike. Just imagine how glorious that would be. Just imagine for one for one minute how glorious that would be. Whoops! That stinks. Hey, Trijars, Trijartista, thanks so much. The Oleta Owl, enjoy your content, makes me laugh and spill my coffee most days. Right on! Well, thanks for popping in and saying hello. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's go... Uh, let's go Sport Fire. We all know we want to see some extra arrows flying around. It's fun. In the name of Hades. <gasps> Fully loaded! If only... If only we had a build where Fully Loaded was awesome. Woo! But we'll take it anyway, because orange. Big crowd, huh? <laughs> yep. Once again, I challenge you to battle.
You! How dare I? Like this. Curses! Woo! Got him. I got him. Yeah. Why do you care so much about this stupid champion, man? You're a cool bull and you care about this dumb champion. I guess he did save you and whatnot. There's a bunch of there's a bunch of positives, I guess. Your relationship has some positive aspects. I'm surprised I haven't found the uh, uh, Dem Demeter uh, Artemis duo boon. Guys have been helpful. Right on. That's mine. <laughs> Isn't that right, Trajar Trajartista? It's so much fun. And I've been playing it for a long time. I still enjoy it. <laughs> so you thwarted the champion of Elysium. Ah, uh, we're just gonna stick with that. The 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 Acorn is 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 quite nice. We're gonna take that. And I think I think we're good there. One more stop. Oh no, in bed but forgot the ice socks. That's like me when I forget to I realize like I'm in bed but I haven't like Locked my door. <laughs> I get the hit. <laughs> oh man, this the same, the exact same conversations at at my house, J Pet. <laughs> the exact same. Um, summer is coming to a close. Uh, Dant. Here's the fee. Oh, <gasps> double strike. <sighs> yes, baby. Yes, and one of these two. Let's go like well, like that, maybe, God's me and like uh, get a one of these. Cause now we got double strike. Time to fish. Link's awakening. I one. Yeah, I once again I I embarrass myself with how how few um console games I ever played. Like, any console games. The last console I owned before now, now I own a Switch. It's like a big deal to own a Switch for me. The last one I owned was a Super Nintendo. And I didn't even play the Link, the, I didn't even play the Zelda game on the Super Nintendo. When I was a kid, like, I didn't know anything about, like, which games to buy. Like, there were, like, the the game shop in my, in my neighborhood, or in my, in my city, like, didn't really carry very many, didn't really carry very many games that looked good, and I just I had no idea what was I had no idea what was good what was good. You have to you have to understand like I grew up I grew up in a in a in another country where it wasn't like I could just go to some like GameStop store or something you know like it was tough it was tough all right it was tough. Have sympathy for me. <laughs> I mean, I did play like Super Mario World. Loved Super Mario. Whoa, yes! Look at this! We gotta build, my friends. We gotta build. It's coming together. It's okay. I appreciate that. I. It's hard though. Like, I, I would want to go back and play like some of those older games, but they're, they're a little tough to get into at this point, I'll be honest with you. Um. They're a little hard to get into. I tried playing Link's Awakening. Uh, or is that... was that No, that wasn't the Super Nintendo one. What was the Super Nintendo one? A Link to the Past. Was that the second one? Or the, the Super Nintendo one? Anyway, I tried playing it on an emulator. I just... I couldn't, like... I couldn't, like, get into it for some reason. Or wherever. I grew up in Taiwan. And then after Taiwan, I grew up in Macau. Which is, like, close to Hong Kong. You oh you played it so much but you never finished it. I finished it like probably like 
dozens of times. I, I don't know how many times I finished it, but like that game, I I could sit in a on a Saturday. I would just like start the game. I would start the game. I would just play it until I killed Bowser right in the face. <laughs> Give a chance to Link's Awakening. It's awesome. Ninety six exits. <laughs> yeah, Mario Brothers Three was great. I played that. I had I had a regular Nintendo too. Before my Super Nintendo. That heart seeking bow you Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, there were, it was such a social thing playing playing uh, playing video games back in the day. Of course, now, like, of my siblings, I'm the only one who still plays video games. Like, I can occasionally get my my brother. Uh, that's Captain Shrimp. Some of you may, some of you may, do any of you remember when Captain Shrimp came and, and played video games with us? That's my brother, by the way. Um, or not Captain Shrimp, excuse me, Uncle Shrimp. Because he's the uncle of my kids and he, uh, he's the uncle of my kids and one, one, uh, 4th of July last year he made shrimp for everybody. So he was forever known as Uncle Shrimp. But he doesn't play video games. He's a he's a a um, programmer at Amazon or uh, an engineer at Amazon, and just he has no time. He says that like video games like they give him a satisfaction that he normally gets from programming, and so he's like, I probably shouldn't get into video games again because I'll stop like doing my job or I'll stop enjoying my job and and will instead play video games all the time like that that's fair that's fair <laughs> anyway yeah I, I occasionally try to convince him to, to jump into games and I have I have like a cousin actually my my uh, cousin one of my cousins was like a semi semi pro uh, player of this this weird obscure first person shooter game. I don't even remember the name of it, like Battle Assault or Assault Life or Battle or like it was something Assault, I think. Anyway, she was like very very good at the game. It's a first person shooter, and she like yeah, it was it was like. Serious, and then she became a caster for the game. I don't know what. Uh, I don't know what. Uh, I wish I knew what the game was called. Doggone! It's it like it was a game that I think all the people who played it thought like this game's gonna be huge. This game's gonna be the next you know whatever. But of course, all people want to play is is the next. And I'm not talking about you. I, I all of you people are are people of culture and taste. But what every, what every kid wants to play is just another Call of Duty game. And 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 now, I guess now it's like they want to play Apex Legends and Fortnite. And then occasionally a game comes out like Among Us and kids get obsessed with Among Us. Which is just hilarious to me. But yeah, it's like those, those obscure uh, FPSs just... It's hard for them to make, make a name for themselves, right? Like you feel for them. You feel for those those uh, those poor game devs trying to make the next competitive multiplayer game. Mario Maker 2. I play that with my kid a little bit every once in a while. I haven't really gotten into it or like gotten too creative with it. Like I don't I don't I don't know. I always think that I could be creative in a thing like that. Like like it was like in Valheim, I think, oh yeah, I'm totally gonna spend a bunch of time on this building and like make it just perfect. And that's never the case. That's never the way it goes. <laughs> it's like <laughs> I start and then I get tired and I run out of ideas and I'm like, oh, it's not worth it. I'll just, I'll just play something else, <laughs> or I'll just go kill some bad guys in a game. All right, we got them. 
We got him. 20 heat. No big deal. Yes. By my father's In the wake of Overwatch, Apex, and Fortnite. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly right. Okay. Aspect of Rama, Splitting Bolt. Man, we got a lot of good stuff here, man. A lot of good stuff. Curse of Vengeance. Heaven's Vengeance. Like, I wasn't even paying attention to how much that uh, Heaven's Vengeance was going off for. That was that was gonna be that was gonna be bonkers. <laughs> All right, friends, it's late and I have school in the morning, and so we are going to bring this stream to a close. And I have a song picked out for tonight, and it's gonna be great. It's it's gonna be great. All right, you're gonna love it. I hope. Hey, Trichard 